to drop the puck here at center. The Senators will start with the puck as they win the opening faceoff here. And that puck leaves the zone. Quick pass to Patherson. Oh, and the puck leaves the zone. They'll be forced to do this one over. Boston's got the puck along the wall. And a stiff break setup. Puck grabbed by Shabbat. And that's knocked away. Moves it quickly over to McAvoy. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Puck picked up by McAvoy. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Oh, what a move with the stick. He's got a chance in front. Oh, beautiful save on the play. And you gotta love these one-on-one -on -one battles. In particular, the goaltender so aggressive, tracks the puck and makes the save. And he takes the feed. And now it's grabbed by Pasternak. The Bruins will play it from the defensive zone. Lindholm's gaining momentum. And they'll go the other way with a great play by Kachuk. Ref's arms in the air. We got a penalty coming up. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Running interference is part of the game, but guess what? You gotta be smart about it. You have to allow your opponent to move freely to find that puck. And get in the way a little bit, but too much, you're gonna get the interference call. Gets it out of his own end. The Senators gain possession. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Kiki's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Handles the puck. Batherson's got it across the line. Boston's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Gets it over to Hogue. Moves the puck to Zadora. He takes a moment to backtrack but maintains possession. Now a quick pass to Kiki. Broken up on center by Arvidsson. Now he takes it over the line. And still gives it a stick to put the puck away. He scores! And there it is, number 20 on the year. Well, that's a milestone, James. It isn't easy to beat the goaltenders in this league, and he's done it 20 times. The goaltenders are just so good in this league, James, that they see the shot, they are going to stop it. And so you got to get traffic in front of the net. On this power play, they do an excellent job of getting bodies in front of the paint. The Senators are first to light the lamp tonight, and let's see where it goes from here. There's been some back-and-forth action, and you have to believe that sometimes when there's one, there's more to come. Taken by Arvidsson. Takes a shot. That sails over the net. Boston's looking to break out of their own end. Centering pass, and that doesn't go as it's off a stick. Slides it quickly to Brandstrom. Here they come on the attack down the right side. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. To the crease. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Omar. Boston's got a hold of the puck. And he takes the dish. Dishes it to Tube. Moves it to the middle. It's gone. Still lots of time left in the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Norris wins it inside the neutral zone. Great defensive effort with the stick. The Bruins have it now. Puck scooped up by Frederick. Directed over to Lindholm. Slides the puck ahead to McAvoy. Here we go, on man rush here. Slips the pass in front, and that's intercepted. Poked away by Lindholm. Moves it to Boquist. Now over to Frederick. 
And it's a quick pass to McAvoy. Here's a chance in front. Picked off in front. Unable to reach that one. Boston's got it in their own zone. And he slides it quickly to Pasternak. Quick shot. Oh, kick save and a butte. Takes it into the slot. Oh, what a save. Uh, that doesn't swing momentum in your favor. I don't know what will, James. That's a last-ditch effort to make a play. What a beautiful save. As we look at that last save again, James, it is absolutely incredible and so impressive to see a goaltender just out-battle and out-will his opponent to find the puck. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Hammers one. Oh, this is the net. That was, what a chance there. Oh, it was a great chance and one that he will want back. The puck is all around him, though. If he continues to get to the right spots at the right time, you got to figure he's going to go one by the Tendi. Read that perfectly with the poke check. Sends it in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Sends the feet in front. And scores! What an opportunity and delivers. That's a hard shot. The goaltender looks like he's just getting to position, gets a piece of it, but it still goes in. Well, yeah, and it certainly changes the mindset. You got a little bit of jump to your step. You're more confident. Now you got to attack. You got to push when your opponent's down. The Bruins take control of the faceoff. And now he moves it quickly to Quinn. Center and feed. And he denies that great opportunity there. And the puck hops out of the offensive zone. They'll be forced to regroup. Scooped up along the wall by Carlo. Slides the puck over to Haig. Feeds it to Quinn. Boston's on the attack. Felino's taking it from his own end. Feeds it across the ice to Quinn. Ottawa's got the puck in their own end. Boston's got possession of the puck. And some textbook body contact there. The Bruins take it along the wall. Scores! Make it three. Just a fabulous shot. When you're in that high slot area, you know that you're going to be closed upon quickly, so you got to have a quick release. That's the first thing. And the second thing is the accuracy. If it's quick and it's on, you're going to score. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Bruins have all the momentum right now, leading by two. The Senators get a hold of the puck off the draw. Out of midair, he swats it down to the ice. Puck picked up by Geeky. I love this save, James. I mean, they can score! Well, I guess they weren't saved by the bell there. Uh, how's that for momentum? In the last seconds of the frame, you find a way to put it in, and that's going to create a ton of momentum. So now, heading into the next period, you want to garner that momentum and carry it forward. The Bruins are up big here late in the first period. Norris wins the draw at center. Here's a shot. Big stop just as time expires in the period. Boston's look great thus far, leading here late in the first period. There's the horn, still 40 more minutes left in regulation time. We'll get to the second period right after this.
Things are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. Here we go. Lots of time left in this one, but certainly a lopsided affair to this point. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? The Bruins have had a strong start to this game. I mean, they possess the puck, and they've had their opponent on their heels all night long, and they've been chasing because of that possession time. When you chase the puck, you open up lanes, and you wear your opponent down. That's exactly what they did, and they've attacked the net. Boston's been the more aggressive team offensively. Look at the shot clock, and just look at the score. The Senators win the draw on their own end. Passes it to Brandstrom. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. Lindholm stick handling in his own zone. Slides it diagonally to Marchand. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. The Senators have it now. Takes it from the right side. The Bruins take possession in the defensive end. Boston's looking to break out. Crosses the puck loose. Ottawa's gained possession. Boston's got the puck. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Fires it. No room for that one to get through. The Bruins played along the way. And he had the answer on that one. But Basalo's really struggled tonight, and the team in front of him as well. They've got to find a way to get back on track. They need to switch the momentum at this game if they want to get back in it. Arvidsson's working it around in the corner. Quick feed to Wenberg. Slick feed. Shot! Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. And he slides it quickly to Foligno. The Bruins have it against the wall. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Look out, here they come on the attack. Stones him in front. And this is a dialed in goaltender, very aware, knows where the shooter is in that low slot and makes the save. The Bruins lead in a big way here in this second. They have been on fire offensively. And they win the draw here in their own end. The Senators will play it in their own end. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. The Bruins need to continue to push and press exactly the way they started this game. I mean, it's halfway through, and they've dominated in every area. Here's a short pass. Oh, stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. Quick feed to Kiki. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. There's only one goal away, James, of his next milestone right here. Chase right in front. And that's off target as it hits a body. Puck sent in, and that will allow for a fresh group of forwards to get out on the ice. The Senators go to work on offense. Oh, what a save in front. Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from and he makes the save. Centering pass! And that's stopped! And they keep the pressure on. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Puck grabbed by Kubalik. From the right wing, he moves into the middle. Sends the pass in front and that goes off a stick and off target. Moves the puck up to Sanderson. Wrists one! And a huge stop by the goaltender at point-blank range. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Quick pass to Kachuk. In close! Denies it in front. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. Denies him with the save! We got a penalty coming up here. Fires it on net! And he uses it! Score! They score on the delay penalty, James, so that's going to negate their power play, but looks like they didn't need it. Oh, he burns the goaltender on that one, picks up the rebound and buries it home. Goalie looks frustrated now, James, knows that you got to redirect that puck to a safe spot. 
Ottawa's got to find a way to get a couple more now after showing some signs of life. The pushback is on. Much more aggressive through this period than they were in the first, James. And they're going to have to continue that, but it's going to start on the faceoff. They have to get a win, own possession, and start distributing the puck. When they do that, they're going to create some speed and some opportunities on net. And that's off the of score. Break for the tender, James. I mean, listen, when structure breaks down and there's all kinds of stuff going on in front of you, you can't track, you can't get your eyes on the puck and it winds up in the back of your net. The Bruins probably don't want this period to end given the way things have played out here tonight. 100% agree with you. They got the mojo, they're moving the puck, they've got a comfortable lead. The last thing they want to do is have an intermission which can pause and give their opponent some rest that they need. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And he keeps possession. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Here he is with the backhander! And a solid save there as we play on. Well, he does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner spot. And he makes himself big, takes away the holes, and makes the save. Centering feed! And that goes off a stick. Quinn's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. And there's the whistle stopping the play. The game is getting out of hand. You're down by a bunch. You take another penalty. You gotta find a way to just reset your composure. Musa quickly over to Hogue. What an opportunity, and it just climbed over the net there. I thought it was in. Well, I thought it was in as well, James. Now he is all around the puck, doing all of the details and habits right. He's gonna cash in at some point. Under siege, and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Get set for the face-off here as they will continue to play short-handed. Bellows is quick on the draw. And that's a great hits up play in the offensive zone. The Senators take it along the wall. And less than a minute to go here in the middle frame. And he moves it up to Marchand. Pokes it away in his own end. Marchand's got it along the boards. Works it across to Norris. The Senators cross the blue line and are on the attack. Can hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Moves it to Marchand. Excellent stick work on the play. tonight as they continue to dominate late in period number two. Uh, and this is the collective and cohesive effort as well. And you know in the intermission, there's going to be a lot of chatter and some relaxation laughs in that dressing room because they have this lead, they have this game. They just want to come out and continue to play the way they started it. And there's the horn, two down, one more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next. Opening face-off for period number three is ready to go. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. How do you view this one? The Senators. He's got a step. Oh, it's a him on the play. Uh, and this is a great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Here's a shot. That eyes him on the play. Now a quick pass to McAvoy. Pokes the puck away. And he takes the feed. Sends the pass over. Stopped by the goaltender. Slides it up ahead from the right wing. Knocks the puck down with a stick. Pasternak's got it along the wing. Quick feed down low. And just a bit outside. The Senators gain possession along the wall. Shot comes up with the stop. Boston's got the puck against the half wall. Tremendous read as he pokes it away with the paddle. Quinn 
Williams made an incredible play there, James. He stumbles in front of the net, but finds the puck and could have lost it, but manages to stay with it enough to get a shot off. Taken along the wall by Pasternak. Both sides digging in for that puck along the wall. And it's a quick pass to Foligno. The Bruins pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Grabs control of it at the point. And that's intercepted by Arvidsson. The Senators move the puck into the defensive zone. Play whistle dead, penalty coming up. Geeky's going off for charging. Listen, a power play, you want to make sure that you're getting a high percentage shooting shot. And that's exactly what they did earlier on the 1-3-1 where they were able to capitalize. It's about opening up lanes, getting the coverage to move around, and then firing and executing when you have it. Higgs moving the puck through his own zone. Takes the return feed. Tries to feed it over to Bellows. Pass across to Chatfield. Coughs up the puck after that hit. The Bruins gain possession of the defensive zone. Handles the pass. Bellows is dancing out there tonight. Yes, his team's blowing the opponent out, but he's got a goal and he's looking for another. He's having a ton of fun. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Levels him with the hit. Nice pass back. Passes on over to Marchand. And he slides it quickly to Chatfield. Here's a pass down low. The Bruins looking against the half wall. Zaka's got the puck in his own zone. Geeky's up and ready to get back on the ice. The Senators' man advantage is over. Well, the PK does a great job, and when you kill a penalty, you create momentum. Great start there. Gets a hold of the puck from the right side. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. The Bruins can simply take this on cruise control based on the lead that they now have here in the third. Winberg's won the draw center. Lindholm's lugging the puck. And he takes the pass. Here's a chance to score! What a goal! That's what you call having a nap for the net, James. When you get in tight and you're sniffing around, you better get that puck off quickly because you know there's defenders all in around that are going to come and close. Boston's performance tonight still showing no signs of let-up here in this third period. Well, they've had such an impressive performance, James. It's been dominant in all areas of the ice, and there's been no lag or no let-up. The message has been clear by the coaching staff as well as everyone on the bench. Keep pushing. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. Boston's got possession at center. Here's a short pass to Wenberg. Passes it in front. What a chance, but they can't connect. Muffs the shot attempt. Takes the feed. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Picked up along the wall by Wenberg. McAvoy's got it in the defensive end. Slides it on over to Wenberg. With possession along the wall. A chance! Oh, what a stick save! The Bruins gain control of the puck. Let's move to the line! Scores! What a finish on the play! We get to the shot off the most coveted area on the ice, right in front of the paint. Doesn't allow the goalie to get set up. Home. The Bruins probably don't want this game to end the way things have gone here. And I know we're in period number three, but Cheryl, what a night. Yeah, it's been terrific right from puck drop. And they've been consistent throughout the game. And consistency is always the word that coaches talk about. And if they can finish this off with this nice lead, that's the word the coach is going to be preaching after the game. Sends a pass over. And that banks off a stick. 
Oh, great use of the body on the play. Power forwards are often heavy on their skates. They're strong, they're physical, and they know how to retrieve pucks. And man, can they deliver bone-crushing hits. Boston's got the puck in the defensive end. And he was ready for that save. Quick pass across to Zaka. Ottawa's got it in their own zone. Kachuk's got the puck. The Bruins gain possession in their own end. Centering feed. Couldn't complete the pass. Looking for space inside the D zone. Passes it over to White. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. Wax it into the offensive zone. Ottawa's got a hold of the puck. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. And now he moves it quickly to Sadora. Rips it. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out across the line. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. The Bruins have it now. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Puck said down the ice. We'll get an icing. Check in with our own Carlin Bain. Who had the better night in that head-to-head -head matchup with the Stars? Pasternak's been great at generating offense, and I've been impressed with his game in this one, guys. Boston's got a hold of the puck. Well, there was certainly pressure on the center to win this draw, coming off of an icing where everyone's tired. You get the win, you get out of your zone. Oh, and a save as he denies him again. Quick feed to Branstrom. And the crowd's on their feet, saluting the team after a hard-fought effort this evening. this team, you, you can just sense they lack confidence right now as a unit. Well, I mean, it's easy to lack confidence when you're not winning games, and you just keep feeling like you're getting pressed down further and further, and they're going to have to find a way to climb the mountain, if you will, James. And it's going to start one shift at a time. I know it's kind of cliche, but they got to get back to the drawing board, back to the video room, and try and reset. That'll do it from all of us here tonight at EA Sports. As one chapter ends, another begins. The clouds are around the corner.